This is Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I am Grayson. Um, so, uh, we are kind of investigating Faravid. Uh, we've been posed with the option to take out the picked leader. Hopefully it is the picked leader. So... I must be careful now. Now, to hunt down the picked chief. So hopefully he's distracted over there. Take out these guys. Um, I just honestly like turned on uh, the recording and then happened to notice that hey, there's a doorway, so let's go that way. Uh, oh, wait, there's treasure. I gotta make sure to get all that later. Is there someone coming? Kinda looks like it. Uh, looks like they turned around. Okay, cool. Make sure I'm not walking into something. to get that guy. Because if I remember the layout, I just simply have to get up this. Hello? Someone see me? And the music's kind of going. Claims that someone saw me. It lied to me. No one came after me. The heck? Who are they fighting? Oh, it's one of my other guys. Oh my goodness, they came in with me, didn't they? I didn't think that they were actually coming in with me. I thought they were just kind of like, Hey, Eivor, go do this, and you'll be awesome. I'll be like, Bish, I know I'm awesome. My thanks, Eivor. Ergis no, I don't want to carry him. Drop. Well, I mean, if we're doing this, then I don't need to worry. Nope, 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 stop it. Oh, that's not good for him. Not even wearing a helmet. Don't do that. I got lucky there. Time to just write. Get your ass up, okay? My thanks, A4. Let's bleed you. Get out of here. Time time is almost up. Um how can we go through here? Yes, we can. Alrighty, so I'm going to leave that person down. And I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'll drive right into... Hello? Where's my target? There he is. in the ass and shoot you in the chest. 
Uh, how do I get in here? There it is. Motor truckers. Assassinate. Fantastic, I got the key now. Like a long roundabout way, but I'm kind of okay with it. And the twist is the pick leader is dead. Oh, I did not see that last one. Oh. Hello, that dodge. Oh, hello. Look who's been focusing on this game. You gonna do a little thingy thing? Yes, you are. Oh, heck no. Alright, are you gonna tell me who your uh, contact is? That's a shame for him. You're on the wrong side of the giant's wall, friend. Have you come to make war in winter? Oh. Fool, he might have talked. We got what we came for. Is that more Frankish wine? I'll take a few casks. And that silver there. Ofer, that's Hafton share. Eivor, just in time to divide the spoils. Take some meat if you like. The Picts had Magnus. This map spells it out. Ah, the wolf kissed is a reader. That stark Seder I'll never mess with. Worry about the Picts later. <laughs> Now's the time for treasure and spoils. You earned it. It should be ours. We did the work. All of it. And nothing for Haftar. Warming his cock in a Saxon castle. Open that cask and we'll have a taste. We'll celebrate together. Sorry, friend, but that's Haftar's take. You understand. Um... Don't make me say it twice. Drag the wine and drink with me. If you insist, we'll all drink some stinking wine. Oh, we can check it out. Maybe now Ulf will shut up. A little sour, but not bad. I've always preferred ale myself. Or spiced mead. What I won't drink is one of Moira's herbal brews. She claims they're a tonic, but there's no telling what she hides in those drinks. Moira? I met her at the feast. She's a herbalist from the north, always skulking in the shadows of Hafton's throne. It's a big throne. Don't you all skulk around it from time to time? Why all these doubts, Eivor? You're a warrior. Not a rumor monger. Doubt is too strong a word. But there is a feeling of mistrust among you. I want this alliance to be ironclad. Then let me change your mind. I've got a plan to win this war for good before the winter sets in. Magnus is a strong fort, but we'd be attacking from the south. With speed, we'll catch them off guard. With Halfton's blessing, I'd fight beside you anywhere. Name the time and place. No, Halfton is done fighting for the winter. He thinks it too great a risk, but I say we can win this war before the next snow. If we tell him of this plan, he'll refuse, but if we succeed, you and I together, he'll sing our praises all the louder. Hmm. I mean, if we do this and we take out 
picks, I mean, it kind of shows that Faravid is potentially telling the truth. And then he did kind of cast a little bit of doubt on Moira. I haven't interacted with Moira, like, at all. Um... Huh. Let's see where this goes, I think. All right, we fight. I swear by Sif's blade, I'll say nothing to Hafton. Good! Good! Victory is ours! I must return to Danacastra for a time, but I will join you for this battle. Deliver this goblet to my Jarl. He has a fondness for them. And tell him his share of the spoils is coming. When you're ready, find me near Jorvik at a place called the Waltz. Uh, let's see what does he have to say. Hafton will be waiting for his gift in Donacaster. Do not keep him waiting. Okay. Well, do I have the the fast travel option? That'd be awesome. Uh, I kind of do. Like right there. So I think if Hafton ends up asking us what uh, what the plan is, I'm gonna tell him. Um, because I mean. I guess lying to Fatavid. I don't know. Like, there's there's that tinge of doubt, but also I kind of feel like maybe Hafton's being paranoid. But I'd like to try and prove Fatavid's innocence. So I don't know. Like, should I should I tell Hafton if the if it comes up? Because I mean, like, this is the type of this is the kind of stuff that like pops up and I'm just kind of like, I wasn't prepared, so like I'm trying to like think, I'm trying to think ahead so that way um, I'm somewhat prepared and we can make these decisions a little bit faster because I know there's been a couple of times in the uh, in the series that I'm just kind of like, duh, I wasn't expecting to think and then it's like, oh well this, this uh, thing affected this later outcome. So, unless, like, basically me telling him that, like, oh, I'm not going to tell him, then, yeah, it's just kind of like, oh, well, you said you weren't going to tell him, so we're not even going to give you the option to tell him. It's like, okay, cool. I didn't know where I was going at the point. Um, you know what? I'll just take the most direct route. Because why not, right? I could just climb. So we'll go talk to Hafdan. Um, I think if it comes up, then maybe I'll let him know. Um, let's just kind of see what ends up happening. Like, if I end up interacting with Moira. I don't know if we will, but I mean, we'll find out. Slow sips, Hafdan. It helps the brew stay down. Drink the rest. Yes, yes. Thank you, Moira. That is all for now. The soothing herbs lift the fog from my mind for a time. How long has she been mixing these for you? You're stalling, Eivor. Tell me what you've learned. What news from the north? The Picts were beaten back. We took their lives and their treasures. Faravid asked me to deliver this. Is he taunting me? Faravid poisons the wine he gifts me. These goblets are a cruel joke. He is mocking me. We did capture some barrels of Frankish Black. He said they were for you, but I made him open a cask. We drank together. There was no poison. Speak without guise, Eivor. Does he plot against me, or no? 
Does he keep secrets? Give me something I can use. Now you must choose between treason and madness. Between the serpent's fang and the bite of a rabid wolf. Faravid asks for my silence, but Hafton expects the truth. If I'm not careful, these lies will pile up, one upon the next. You have grown awfully silent, Wolfkist. Well, that's... <sighs> That just makes it sound like he's planning an attack against Hafdan. Faravid has planned an attack on the Picts at Martinus. Without you. That twin-faced backstabbing glory eater! Well, tell me. I won't know until we meet again. A place called the Walls. Good. Go to him. Watch, listen, unearth his lies. You will find them. If you fear poison, Lord, you must consider everything. Even Moira's brew. Impossible. Moira has been with me for an age. She is no witch, she is kind and... <sighs> Perhaps you can speak with her and find out for yourself. She stays within Donacaster, not far from here. If you learn something, find me north of Donacaster. One of my scouts there has troubling news. Heal, Beonton! We're going for a walk down to the temple. Alrighty, so now we get to go talk to Moira. Which is kind of what I wanted to do. Um, where is she? Let's see that one. Meet Faravid. The Wolds. I should see Moira about this brew she's been feeding Afton. No sense wasting a fine goblet. <laughs> um, hmm. I'm trying to see if maybe she's in this area. Because I thought he said that she stays within Donacaster. speak to Moira. She lives in the south area of Donacaster. Okay. So the south area, so we're talking like down over here. About this lab, my friend. There it is. So she's supposed to be over there. So, yeah, I mean, we'll check out every lead that we have, just to make sure that everyone's clear. Because for some reason, like, he thinks that they're after him. But, I mean, unless I'd be able to talk to Uba, like, we don't know very much. Like, is this normal for Hefton, or is this just brand spanking new? What you got, kid? You would imagine oh. we would run up. I didn't come back any Yeah, I didn't mean to run into you. Moira's not here. What's this? Dear Sister Moira, we spoke at the feast about my wife's condition, but I fear that it is it has worsened. I fear that she may not wake again. Please, I beg you to come to Wyke with haste. This letter came from Weekend. 
She must have gone there. I should go to... Good day. Oh, it's a horse riding shop. I will see you later, friend. Okay, so I want to go talk to Moira first. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I don't know if he's just being paranoid or what. So that's where she is. Alrighty. Well, um, and for the sake of time, we'll be ending it here, continuing the investigation. Um, I'm really hoping that Hafden doesn't do anything that kind of gives me away because then that's going to complicate my investigation into Faravid and potentially proving his innocence. It kind of sucks that we have to do this whole backhanded thing, but. I don't know, I guess this is... I mean, this is what makes these games interesting, so... Um, I have been Grayson. This is, of course, Assassin's Creed Valhalla for PlayStation 5. Uh, if you've been enjoying yourselves, by all means, leave a like. Uh, do the comment thing, hit the subscribe button, and that notification bell, so that way you know when the episodes pop up. Until then, I hope you uh, make better choices than myself, or just stay out of drama. <laughs> so, until then... Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other.